all right guys this is Deepan Gogoi technical analyst of Alice Blue so in this video I'll discuss about zinc so as I discussed uh, yesterday so I told that here was some zone was so I told after breaking this area don't enter in this market wait to retrace the market toward this zone so this zone is forming by moving average 200 now you can see we have seen price just broke this 200 moving average again reverse back to near 200 moving average so this is uh, most of the time it's happening after breaking the support and resistance like support or resistance whatever after breaking this supporting re uh, sorry resistance line always price retrace toward this supporting line and it, it will be become a support and again reverse back and uh, similarly in a supporting zone uh, after breaking this supporting line price again retrace toward this supporting line and it will be act like a resistance and after the price again drop down so similarly yesterday we have seen after breaking this uh, 200 moving average or somewhere here support was 186 line so we have seen price again retrace toward this supporting line and both are acting as a strong resistance now you can see first time we have seen when price retrace three confirmation we have seen what their three confirmation one is a horizontal line who is placing a resistance and next 200 moving average and the third we have seen this is a 50 moving average all are acting as a resistance so that is a good a sign right uh, it's a high probability sell entry and again same thing you can see here retrace toward 50 moving average again price drop down again retrace again drop down so that is our uh, bounce vectoring strategy right so why i told to enter below this area so yesterday i already explained here let me zoom a little more now we have seen this is a large candle followed by a smaller candle followed by even smaller candle first sign that means they're losing their momentum when pricing price are pushing up toward upside and they're losing their momentum so most of the people are thinking here right right here this candle small this candle small this candle large so if you want to see the volume of this candle this candle are more forceful like more momentum comparatively than this one let me check it let me tell you right we must use volume indicator right okay where is the volume indicator volume indicator volume volume yeah this one volume indicator let me use now now now, now. yeah yeah okay have you seen what i told that was lower and the next you can see this candle have you seen that means comparatively this candle is very small like a pin bar but if you want to see here the volume of this candle is too big right too high all right okay let me remove this one okay because i never use any indicator remember except the moving average when i trade okay now we have seen this is a large candle followed by a smaller candle followed by even smaller candle. criteria number one they are losing their momentum so it is a good sign or it is a sign of reversal why because this is a key point when price is approaching suppose this is a key point when price is approaching toward this key point they are losing their momentum key point that means raise stand line they are losing their momentum when they are losing their momentum it's a high probability to reverse back from this area number one and according to the price action method i'm not talking this one about this price action method because in my in my video i already uh, i think in my blog or video somewhere i already explained there is various type of uh, price action method 
right most of the people does know only they knows only high low high low high low that is the price action according to them but not only like that right by using candlestick pattern we can focus uh, we can find out the price action right and according the price action method we have seen higher point higher point higher point all every day they are creating higher higher but next day they fail to create a higher according the candlestick pattern uh, candlestick price action they fail to create new high have you seen this was previous day high and the next day it is high so after that we have seen a dozy pattern which is bearish and they confirm us the price will reverse from all entire bullish momentum are loose right that is the sim, uh, symbol and uh, similarly I can see here this was most uh, like uh, testing like uh, multiple testing area here here like that here somewhere here so we drawn a supporting line. that means we will start selling from this area right and after that we have seen insert bar everything every criteria are there so that is why high probability there and remember always find out more and more criteria right and all always find out uh, like uh, before you enter in this market always find out the logic behind uh, the market why you are uh, going to enter in this market right so we have seen many logic are there price are trying to reverse from this area now let's check it in a four hour time frame uh, how it should look like that and in a four hour time frame it should look like double top right double top in a four hour i'm not talking in a small time frame small time frame i think they will show you some uh, one of my youtube guy he asked me he told me i think he told me about uh, here he's in four or something top yeah in a small time frame but in the large time frame we have seen only two double uh, double top right so and here we have seen this is a neckline or you can see like that at that time now we have seen another most of the people are confusing here let me show you and we have seen here on one supporting line and another here Taylor so who is one best so in that case we are using what zone right in that case we are using some zone like that here we have seen higher point and zone are there and this is called supporting zone at that time now it's becoming a resistance so now you can remove this one right okay now we have seen a zone now i think uh, confused are uh, clear now for our we have seen double top and they broke this neckline so you can say like that every everything like m pattern most of the people are say like m pattern you might you heard about that right and this is called neckline they broke the neckline you know and they broke this neckline is a high probability to reverse now uh, most of the people are projecting the market if they are forming this type of neckline where is our target so in that case let me tell you let me draw the m properly okay pull and now it's here market right so let me check it how many point are there how they project the market so it is lower point and here higher point almost uh two 235 right 235 here we need 235 somewhere here 235 uh, yeah exactly in a red line here so let me draw a line here now you can see here okay so now uh, most of the people are projecting if they break this level where is our target so target is there in this area so they are calculating like that suppose this is the okay 
this portion is equal this portion right they are calculating so they are setting the target like that okay so we need more confirmation either there are some support or resistance here so we have seen some support uh, in a below so we can we can adjust a little more and we have seen here some support are there so you can project like that right so what trading strategy today we are going to use here let's check in a small time frame so we have seen in a prices in a downtrend and that right now you can see prices running in a range so find out the range how we will find out the range so i want to connect more tosses area here have you seen i connect more tosses area so let me let me draw some resistance line by connecting here and then now you can see i want to connect here have you seen price is running like that now now price is running like that this range reverse back again reverse back again reverse back. so now trading strategy is we must wait to retrace again or if you want to see uh, price right now they are following moving average 50 they are bouncing from moving average 50 exponent here. so you may wait to retrace this sorry uh, retrace the price toward 50 moving average so we can sort again in this area but not now most of the people are thinking hey price broke this supporting line start sell here start selling here so once they start selling in this area price are giving a retracement and hit their cell and after that they're thinking somebody are watching my mark my my market and when i start selling price suddenly push up and hit my cell and after that again reverse back nobody are watching your trading remember you try to understand where is your entry point and where is your exit point and keep your passion most of the people are thinking hey i'm i have to enter in this market right now otherwise i will miss the opportunity this is called fomo fear of missing out and 90 percent people are affecting it's a big disease you know in uh, during this trading the disease uh, like fairness greedy all are disease and use some capsule what is the capsule trading strategy use the trading strategy keep your face on so where to where to retrace up to this area because we have seen uh, in a previous market we have seen prices bouncing uh, 50 moving errors bounce from 50 moving errors bounce from 50 moving errors and the next the high probability when price will retrace toward the 50 moving errors it is a high probability to reverse back again all right so wait if you are not getting any opportunity leave it to the market right opportunity always comes here always you will find the opportunity so that is why you just wait to proper opportunity right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching